Hey y'all, I am Laura and welcome back to Confident Notions. Um, yeah, I got my hair cut yesterday. Got my roots did, got my cut hair cut because it grew really fast in like 12 weeks. I go every six weeks to get my roots done. It got long. So this is my what is going in my kid and my husband's stocking for Christmas video. I don't think all of this is going to fit into their stockings. I will also preface this by saying my husband doesn't like to do stockings. Partially because like there's no thrill of the stocking for him. I've said this before, my husband's Jewish. And so he's like, why do we have stocking? What do we put in a stocking? I was like, so he doesn't have like years of like what you get in stockings to like go by. I was like, look, put like some candy and some chapstick and some nuts in the stocking and like you're good to go. Like on, if all else fails, candy, chapstick, nuts anything else is golden and he was like oh. so this here is a combination of things that I got for him and Morgan um it's not all gonna fit but it's fine it's cute so first up I did get him a box of peanut M&Ms I so Morgan and I were at five below last night and we were getting some Christmas gifts for for some folks and that's usually the only place that I can find Jolly Joes. Jolly Joes are the grape version of Mike and Ike's and my husband loves all things grape flavored. They didn't have them. They always have them. They didn't have them. I don't know why they didn't have them. But they're like, the they didn't have them. And I'm like, ah. So I got some peanut M&Ms anyways. Next up, this is actually for my stocking because I grabbed it. Um, Icebreakers, ice cubes, gum in cinnamon. Now, fun fact, what you know about Laura is I am allergic to aspartame, which caused me great sorrow because when I say this girl loved her some Diet Coke, I loved, loved some Diet Coke. And I can't drink it anymore because of the aspartame. It makes me really sad. But a lot of the majority of gum all have aspartame in it, which is stupid, except cinnamon gum. There are very few cinnamon gums that have aspartame in them, and more likely than not, your cinnamon gum will not have aspartame in it. I don't know if there's something with like the chemical reaction between like cinnamon oil and aspartame, but I don't care because one, I love cinnamon. Two, I can't have aspartame. So it's like a win-win-win for me. So I bought this for me for Kevin to put into my stocking. Um, some ice cubes, cinnamon gum, or I just might throw it in there now because I can eat this and it's cool and I'm excited because I can have some gum. And to go along with that, I actually got him, remember, Kevin loves grape flavors. Um, this is the ice cubes and arctic grape and you know what it has in it? Brum, 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 aspartame. Anyways, he's not allergic to aspartame, so he can have him some icebreakers, grape gum. But I can't. Next up. Oh, this I also got for myself. So remember I said, like, you can't go wrong if you put, like, some candy and nuts? The one thing that my brother and I always, always, always got in our stocking was the Lifesavers storybook. Now, if you are old like me, you'll remember when the Lifesavers storybook was two sides and it had multiple flavors in it. So this one here, you get just like, what? Five rolls, six rolls. You get six rolls of just the regular kind. When I, in the eighties, you would get two rolls of like five each. And there was a regular kind, there was butter rum, there was like a tropical flavor one, and there was all cherry, I think. And then there's one I was missing. If you remember what I'm talking about, comment below, cause you know what I mean, right? So I picked up this for my own stocking for a little bit of nostalgia and Kevin can put that in my stocking too. I'm just going to give these to him and be like, put this in my stocking. I got you started. You'll be good. All right. Also for Kevin's stocking, I picked this up for him. So this I got at Walmart. It was like five bucks. And this is the multi-tool. My husband is not a handyman at all um he doesn't use tools really and it's fine it's fine i don't care but what happens is he wants to come in here and get into my toolbox because remember i have my own special toolbox where i keep all my stuff so that he doesn't get into it so then 
I know where it is. So I thought if I got him this multi-purpose tool, it's got pliers, wire cutters, knives, bottle opener, can opener, screwdriver, and all, a file, a saw, a medium slotted screwdriver, and a small slotted screwdriver, and a sheath is included. I thought, well, that is a fine multi-purpose tool for Kevin to have. So that's gonna go in his stocking. Then I got some candy canes. I picked up the Reese Pieces one for me. Uh, this is gonna go in my stocking, so I'll put this in my little stocking pile. Uh, for Morgan, I got the M&Ms because she loves M&Ms and she especially loves red M&Ms. And then for Kevin, I got uh, some Reese's. So I got the Reese cup one for his stocking. Then, this child is gonna be so hyped up on sugar, like just bouncing off the walls. So for her, I picked up the Lifesaver gummies. So I, I don't let her have hard candy yet because I don't want her to choke, but I think she's gonna love some gummies. So this is the Lifesaver gummy book. <clears throat> and I don't know what's inside of here. There's wild berry and five flavor. I never had these. I was old school. I just always had the tubes. So we shall see. Let's see what else with the candy. Then I got her the Skittles Twist and Pour um, Santa. Oh, he's got like a horrific mouth there. Mm. It's gonna fall out of. This ain't all gonna fit. <laughs> so I picked her up that. <clears throat> Then also for the candy, oh, I saw these at Target. It's the Kinder Joy, but it is Disney princesses. So there's like a Disney princess in the Kinder Joy. And I thought that was really cute. So sweet cream topped with cocoa wafer bits. I've never had a Kinder Joy before. I have had a real Kinder like overseas when, you know, cause it's not illegal over there because they believe that the citizens of their countries are capable of not choking on a toy when they eat the chocolate but here in the u.s we aren't so i've had a kinder egg overseas but not the kinder joy speaking of kinder i also picked up this to divide amongst their stocking and this is the um what is it just the, the milk chocolate is there flavor inside of here i don't think so i think it's just the regular snowman so they're getting um, snowmen as well. Then for my husband, he is also getting the little Lindor milk chocolate bag. You get two in this here, but he likes these. So I'm going to put those in his stocking. Is that it for the candy? I think so. No. And then also, uh, I got this for my husband's stocking, but I also got him the Reese cups, so I'm not certain. But these are the Reese's trees. These are just the regular Reese trees. And um, I don't know what it is, but Reese peanut butter cups taste better when they're a tree or an egg. I think they taste best as an egg. And then second is the tree. Why are shapes tastier? I don't know. But they are. Moving on. So next up, to go with all of that chocolate and sugar, I got, oh, thank God, these are Anna. So I picked up Morgan a pack of Frozen 2 toothbrushes. I did Target pick up for these, and I thought that I would get two different people, like two different characters on the bottom, but they're both Anna, thank God, because Anna is her favorite. Um, but she needed a, some new toothbrushes, so she's gonna get a big girl toothbrush to go with that. Speaking of the girl, I found this at Target also. It's a Frozen 2 magnetic dress-up doll. So it's a magnetic dress-up Elsa. When I tell you we're going to have Frozen Christmas, like, we're going to have Frozen Christmas this year. So much Frozen. So she's going to get that in her stocking. Then, I don't know if these books are going to fit in here. But I did pick her up two blind box bags. This one here is Disney Princess's Palace Collection. And there you get um, like one of these princesses inside or a random guy or the beast. 
right? So I picked her up this a while ago. I think on Black Friday I did, and then she was with me and she didn't see it. And then I also picked her up this today. This is the Frozen 2 Collectible Plush. This is really cute. We picked up one of these before and she got the fire lizard and she's just like obsessed with that damn fire lizard. So I picked up another one of these. Hopefully it's not another fire lizard and it's somebody else inside, but I thought those were fun. I told you I'd be watching like all of these, like what I got my kid for Christmas and what my kid's getting for in their stocking videos. And everybody's talking about like, oh, I have a three-year-old and they're going to get this blind box and this blind box and like Polly Pockets. I'm like, mm, I, don't, I don't need all that small shit in my house. Not only that, like she, not old, she, ain't, she ain't old enough for that yet. I'm going to hold off as much as I can. So let's see what else do we have in here. Oh man, this came apart. Son of a gun. So I did get her this lip gloss from the Dollar Tree and it was, um, it is a pink diamondy shape one, which she is not gonna be able to get that open. I'll put it in there just like this. She'll probably play with it or whatever, stick her finger in it, but it's cute. So she got, remember? Gotta get a chapstick in your box, in your uh, in your stocking. So I got her that. I did get her a couple of coloring books and some books. I don't know if these books won't fit. Let's be real. Um, I got these at the Dollar Tree. So I got Ariel's Treasures. And then I also got this Daniel Tiger book. So this is Daniel Gets Scared. She liked it, this story, but she's kind of grown out of Daniel Tiger. I'm not sad about it. So I don't know, I might put that in there. And then this one here, Disney Princesses, Light and Love. And I thought that she would like that. So this is Cinderella. And she's been wanting to watch Cinderella 3 a lot. Sequels are very good. Cinderella 3 is okay. It's not great. Little Mermaid 2 can go to the garbage, in my personal opinion. But So this is cute. So I think she'll like that. I also did pick her up a coloring book, but I don't think this is going to fit. And she just might get this early. These are not the best. Like, I could look. Come on, Dollar Tree. Like, I could draw that better. And I am a crappy drawer. Like, a four year old drew that. Anyways, it's fine. Winter Wonderland. So, I got those. I don't think I'll get those in her stocking. I also did pick up this for her, this Frozen 2 clipboard set, and it comes with a travel clipboard and sketch pad. She actually, um, Miss Wanda gave her this for Christmas today. So I'm gonna put this aside. She can go get this right now. She go get this another time. We'll save that for another day. <laughs> it's so funny she opened it. It was like, I totally have those. She's, we're like, well, we shot at the same place. Um, then I told you to pick these up at the Dollar Tree. So these are Disney princesses, like tiny little sticker fingernail art. So I'm going to put one of those in her stocking. And I also have this pack of Disney princess playing cards. So we can teach her how to play poker with some Disney princesses. And last thing I got for her, I picked these up at Hobby Lobby when I went on my massive quest to find balls, lights, anything. And they didn't have any anywhere. But they did have these, which were marked as holiday 2020, 66% off. So we've got an Olaf and a Sven. Um, and these are the Thai Beanie Baby-esque things, right? Um, and so these were like five bucks a piece. They were usually like $14.99. I was like, that was way too much for a tiny stuffed animal. But I picked up both of these because I love when there's a little stuffed animals sticking out of the top of your stocking it's like my favorite thing so these guys are gonna go stick out of the top of her stocking and it's gonna be hella cute so yeah that's it that is what i got in their stockings so i hope you like that i hope you all are doing well hope you're staying safe and sane and healthy and all that good stuff um if you like it please go ahead hit that like button subscribe and comment and all that good stuff and i'll see y'all soon bye